This is Mr. Burley at St. Elizabeth Catholic School. This is the second tutorial in the Fusion 360 sculpting. Last time we left off, it looked something like this. Now you notice, if I went to the top view, you notice this is in the wrong spot. So all you do, if, if yours is like that, right click, move it, just bring it right out to the edge. Click OK. Go back to here. OK, so we're going to go to the right view. I want to bring this forward to here, and then we're going to bring the back out. So the first thing we do is click on this guy, scroll in, I'm going to grab this edge here, this edge here, and this edge here. I'm going to edit the form. I'm going to go to the right view so I can see my canvas. I'm holding the Alt key down and I'm going to bring this guy forward, something like that. You can play with it and line it up really, really nicely. I'm not going to worry about it for this purpose. Click OK. Come back here. This is the kind of thing that it's it's really, you can just tinker around with it and get it perfect if you, if you choose to, which is what my expectation would be if I was, if, if you were doing a project. Um, hold the Alt Control key down, select these guys here, right click, edit form, right view, and see what I'm doing. Alt key down, bring him back to something like that. And like I said, you can come in here and you can right take that and you can, you can, you know, adjust all this stuff, and you can select each one of these lines and just, you know, play with it. Get at each each one of them here like this, and you can bring him out like that. And, you know, you can take your time, and you can do that. You can bring this guy here, edit form, select that one, edit form, bring him up a little bit more so it looks more like the Audi. Right click that guy here, same thing, bring him up. You know, you can change the angles and all the rest of it. Okay, now I'm going to go right click. Roll, it, roll the model over here. I'm going to click OK. And I'm going to go this guy here. Control key here, here, and here, and here. And I want to roll it a little bit inboard. So I'm holding the Alt key down now. And I'm just going to go in just a little bit, not too far. That's too far. If I bring the Shift key down here, just slide it back out. Something, yeah, maybe a little bit like that, just a little bit of a lip. Right, click OK, right view now, and this thing here, I'm going to edit for him and bring him back down. OK, now I'm going to start to wrap the front of the car. So I'm going to click this guy here, and this one here, control key down, click him, control, control. Problem with my mouse here. I think it's I've selected a whole face. That's not good. The surface I'm using my mouse on is not the best. Right click, edit form. So I'm going to grab the Alt tab and bring it around the front like this. And now you can see the car starting to wrap. I want to line it up something like that. Click OK. And the same thing with the back of the car. Spin around this way. And click this. Control, control, right click, edit form, and I'm going to bring him back. So if I hit the black back view, I can see how far to come. It's kind of looking all distorted here. Click OK. Okay. Okay, I had a little bit of a mistake there. So Coming back here, I'm going to hold the control key down. I select this surface, this surface, and this one. Right click, hold the Alt key down, wrap him back, something like that. I'm go to the back view now, see how far to bring it. So it lines up roughly there. Click OK. Alright, starting to look like a car. Now I'm going to go to the right view. And I select, roll the model forward a bit. I'm going to select this guy here, edit form. And I'm going to go to the right view now. Pull him up. So I'm going to start stretching it. And again, you can play with this and make it perfect um, for your own self. But I can come in here like this one and I can, you know, play with him a bit. And I can wrap this up. So you can you can get this one here. You can see I can change the angle of that so it's a little bit more like my right. Something like that. Anyways, you play with yours so it's perfect. That's good enough for this demonstration. And I click OK, and you can see it's starting to become a car now. Now I'm going to select this edge here, Control key, this one, this one, this one, 
this one. Right click, edit form, and I'm going to hold the Alt key down again. I'm going to go this way now, and I'm going to bring it right across, to bring the top in, and the same thing. I want to bring it so that it's lined up. So I'm going to go to the front view now so I can see how far to bring it. So There you go. Something like that. I'll click OK. The isometric view. Now you can see it's starting to look like a model. That's the next step. So close all that in. And the next video I'll show you how to mirror it over and sometimes we run into problems with the mirroring and, uh, and it gets all funny but we'll, we'll go through that in a second.